they really getting into. That's why I really don't post like me at work no more because I'm not one of them new TikTok drivers. Y'all, I've been doing this shit for seven years. I'm not new to this. What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Breaking Truckers. What could I say? I know if I gave the wrong answer, I mean, Nikki, Ginger, Ace, all of them could have wound up getting killed. Because there's one thing about these old timers. They don't like any fucking around with the other guy's wives. It's bad for business. So I lied. Even though I knew that by lying to Gaji, I could wind up getting killed too. Nifa Ni nee is here to say that she been in this for seven years. She is not new to this. No more wasting time. Let's get it. Hold on. Y'all, I want to talk about the post that I just posted before this. Um, somebody put a meme saying I jumped in the trucking industry just like um, girls go get BBLs because of the internet. And like, that's probably, that has a lot of truth to it. The internet could be so influential and people be getting into the trucking industry and don't know what the fuck they really getting into. That's why I really don't post like me at work no more because I'm not one of them new TikTok drivers. Y'all, I've been doing this shit for seven years. I'm not new to this. I'm not no rookie no more. Like, that's been over with. But like, when you coming out here, when you first getting your like CDL, you not gonna make a lot of money. And I tell that on my YouTube channel, but people don't be paying attention. Y'all come out here thinking y'all finna get the bag, get the bag. No, you're not. You're not. You're finna be broke. Mm -hmm. That's the reality of it. And you need to start doing your research with these companies because they slapping y'all head. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. They are slapping your head left and right when you get out here in the trucking industry. Yo, guys, it's so influential that y'all think that's that the trucking industry is a trend right now and being that it's a trend that's the thing that you guys want to do y'all think y'all gonna come out here and make this money you think you guys gonna come out here and get this bag you think you guys gonna be instant millionaires that is far 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 from the truth listen guys been in this business for more than 30 years and haven't even seen or crossed that threshold yet it's all about getting out here doing what you need to do and when you get out here to do what you need to do that's when you start saving money now i understand saving money is kind of hard when you have responsibilities like home kids cars but if you would take maybe maybe a 50 100 dollars a week or because a lot of you get in it sorely just to make money because y'all think that y'all will become instant millionaires which is not the case but if you save and do what you need to do then maybe just maybe you will probably see the gold at the end of the rainbow but don't get caught up though because this internet right here is very very tricky it can it can fool y'all telling you it could fool y'all it will tell you one thing and then when you get into it you'll learn that is a whole different ball game big cheese got it locked boy won't you let me all night yeah take me down won't you make me real way yeah swim around won't you to take it like a g and yeah, don't make a sound and i want you to miss me when i'm not around come dive in my ocean for my pool my love is like Tell you I don't fuck around Cause they got you insecure You and your feelings